Under municipal insurance, I'm going to have the same thing that Amanda from the library had. We do. I think you guys all received, Fred, you gave them the letter with the rate increase for health insurance? I did. Yes. Okay. So health insurance, um, basically when I generated these budgets, we didn't have the health insurance number, so I basically put in what the current cost was to cover all the employees who have the insurance. And now that we have the rates, they went up 6.1% um, for health insurance. Of course, I don't know where my health insurance pile went, but and then the dental went up three point something, I think. Nine. So the uh, bottom line is that we need to increase um, our health insurance line from we need to increase it to two million nine hundred and seventeen thousand eight hundred and twenty five dollars in order to cover um, all of the people who are all the positions not people they are positions because right. we have vacant positions but we still budget for them so we will need to make that increase um the board will need to do that whenever it is that you guys decide that you're going to address that because i know the library needed one i i know shirley gave you guys something you can cut from her budget so i can get all those numbers together for you guys if you'd like populate Good. the board of selectmen <coughs> column on the summary sheets and then you guys would have that mm -hmm. to look at because I think it's easier for you to yeah. understand it and if you see the numbers in front of you as opposed to me rattling numbers off to you so we will need to make an adjustment there other than that um, the insurance is the insurance little to no control over it I mean we have to have right. workers comp insurance yeah. right. you have to have life insurance as part of everyone's collective bar I mean there's nothing in this part I mean besides the NHMA dues that I mean it's all things that are contractually required I guess yeah. Any questions? No. Seeing none, 